Hi guys, I'm back. This is True Sugar and I'm coming at to you today with a review on YFB. Um, you can find this at HSN. And this kit, I believe it's called the um, um, Beauty Basis and Beyond. And in this kit, I got a Neutralizing Cream and Illuminating Cream Duo. I got a Brighten, Hide, and Sculpt Your Face Trio. A Neutralized Press Powder and one Automatic um, brow pencil and a universal taupe and a um, bronze and blush duo. So right away I can get to you the only thing that I truly have enjoyed in this kit is the brow pencil and it's on, excuse me, this one. And you can tell the difference from how my brows look kind of sparse over here, pulled in over here. But the one thing I did not like is that they said um, when you, she does her little pre, her little preview thing you see all types of colors but when you look at this is it these are all the same colors. I'm trying. I was trying to get um, different looks, but I, it didn't work. They all look the same. Just pressing hard on that. So, if you were someone who was trying to give this as a gift to someone else who had like really blonde brows and stuff, I just don't think that this would work. And unfortunately for me, um, this was the only thing I liked out of the kit. This is the um pencil. And it's kind of, and the packaging is really nice though. I know that this has a great following, so I wasn't overly concerned. And this is the brush, and I used the brush to, um, excuse me, to smooth it out over here, and I liked it. So now we can get to, um, and this is the bag that it came in. It's pretty. Everything in it is nice. The packaging was good, but for me, the main reason that it didn't work is because the colors are too light. So first of all, this is the, this one is the neutralizing cream and illuminating cream. This is a yellow, and this is like a, this is the luminizing cream. These colors are just too light for me. Um, they don't work. Um, this yellow just makes my skin look ashy, and when I put product on top of it, it, it doesn't work. Um, once again, the packaging looks nice. For someone who, who is um, of a lighter complexion than myself, I think it would probably work fine. Because I love the textures of the kit. It just isn't working out for me. This is the concealers that come with this kit. And no. This is the concealers that come with this kit. And as you can see, you know, I bought it. Because, like, you can use the, the last one. But if you look on, the, well, I'll pop it on this side of my face. That's too light. That's Ash Blash right there like even if I were to try to pop it and like the texture of it is nice and it's creamy like I just kind of look ashy right there I couldn't really you know compare it. well that's not the most beautiful to apply this but it's not a good look by right, looking head on this looks sick excuse me this side looks sick and this side looks healthy um so i can't really recommend this product just not really because of the of the product itself because it's nice and creamy it feels really nice but because it's just not deep enough for me okay but this was the concealing trio you can seal with it you can neutralize it, and then you can also um contour contour excuse me with that and then this is your golden gleam bronzer and your baby pink blush okay this is what that looks like and <laughs> for both colors on me <laughs> yeah this bronzer is an ashy mess and this just It just comes off looking very powdery. I, I don't know what to say. I tried to make myself up with this um, palette, y'all. The whole shebang. I was going and I was gonna try to walk. I couldn't even walk out the house. I couldn't do it. I couldn't, and I couldn't lie about how I looked. You know, it just wasn't working. So one, two, three, four, and I'm missing one more product. Ah, right, here we go. This is the Neutralizing Press Powder in Yellow, okay? This is how that powder looks. Now, 
to me, this is kind of light, too. I don't know. These products are just giving off an ashy tone. If you have ever checked out the Ben Nye Press Yellow Banana Press Banana Powder, it's it's deeper than this. To me, this is, gives off an ashy tone, too. It doesn't neutralize anything. I don't really know why it didn't really work out for me. And just a swatch, you can see just how it kind of looks. And just kind of over here. So you just see it looks kind of just a little ashy. I don't know. This didn't work out for me. Um, but for someone who is of a lighter complexion, I would say give this line a go. I should have known when I was looking at the darkest complexion girl that she looked kind of ashy in the face anyway to me. But I was like, maybe it's just the bad lighting. But no, the makeup was making her look ashy. Um, once again, the products come with a card that lets you know how to use the items. And also for YFB, which was, I believe, known as Models Prefer. There's also this, um, this, this is the young lady who's the creator and the founder and I believe the CEO or whatever. She's the one who you will see on HSN. And then in this hand, this book, excuse me, his, in this book, excuse me, you'll get all kinds of info. In this book, you'll get all kinds of information about contouring, um, using um, the shape of your eyes and things of that nature. So even how to like shape, do makeup for your certain eyes, excuse me, you know, they have all kinds of methods and how they list them, but it didn't work for me, even from your lips. They have something for your lips, but I'm at a point now that I'm not going to keep a whole bunch of product for one for one for one and it's not really overly special or anything it's just an okay product so that's my thoughts on that um i'll also be reviewing from them the foot pedals yeah i'll get let y'all know about that. I've been trying to find other things online about the foot pedal, but I'm having a hard time just even finding foot pedals in my city. Um, they're sold at Dillard's and also at Charm and Charlie's. But I'm going to have to talk to y'all about the foot pedals. You know, see if there's anybody else that's used them and how they like them. But um, once again, if you've tried any other YF and B, see, that's just a hot mess. It's a hot mess take this off um excuse me so please comment let me know your thoughts let me know if you tried this line if you are of a darker complexion and let me know how it worked for you i haven't worn a mac foundation and kimberly and um sue david i wear kimberly plateau and then black opal i wear beautiful bronze um thank you and i'm sharing my thoughts and excuse me and please share your thoughts with me have a good day